Hello students, let's work out the following problem. It says an electric fan is available for rupees 600 cash or for rupees 250 cash down payment followed by three monthly installments of rupees 125 each. Find the rate of interest charged under the installment plan. So let's now move on to the solution. We are given that the cash price or CP of fan is rupees 600 and the cash down payment is rupees 250 therefore balance due That is after paying rupees 250, balance due will be rupees 600 minus 250. That is rupees 350. Now we are given that the number of installments. is equal to 3 and the amount of each installment is rupees 125 therefore amount paid under installment scheme or in three installments is equal to rupees 3 into 125 since there are three installments and amount of each installment is rupees 125 so this is equal to rupees 375 and also, therefore, interest paid under installment scheme is equal to rupees three seventy five minus three fifty. That is balance due. So it is equal to rupees 25. Now, principal for first month is equal to rupees 600 minus 250. That is 350, that is the balance due. Now, principal for second month is equal to rupees 350, that is principal for the first month, minus 125, that is installment paid in the first month. So, this is equal to rupees. 225. Now the principal for third month is equal to rupees 225 that is the principal for second month minus the installment paid in second month and this is equal to rupees 100. Now the total principal for one month is equal to sum of all these principal which is equal to rupees 675. 
Now the interest is given by principal into rate into time upon 100. Now the interest paid under installment scheme is rupees 25. Let's name this as 1 and this is 2. So interest is equal to rupees 25 principal is rupees 675 time is 1 by 12 since we have obtained the principal for one month time will be 1 by 12 and the rate of interest we have to find and we will assume this to be our percent so the interest is given by Twenty five is equal to six seventy five into R into one upon twelve upon hundred. So from this we have twenty five hundred is equal to six seventy five upon twelve into R. So this implies 2500 into 12 is equal to 675R. So this implies R is equal to 2500 into 12 upon 675. So this implies R is equal to 44%, 44.4%. Hence the rate of interest is 44.4%. So this completes the question and the session. Bye for now. Take care. Have a good day.